Hello everyone and welcome to what is going to be another unboxing video because I, I was actually kind of shocked on this one because I thought we got one last month as well but I guess they were running a little bit behind and they ended up doing this this month or are they doing them now monthly? I don't know. Usually these were bi-monthly but we got another slam crate today. So we got another WWE slam crate and... It, no, like I said, it was very interesting because I thought we just did one last month. Usually we get the other ones uh, from that wrestling club on a monthly basis. But it looks like we got a, another one this month from Slam Crate. Uh, that's an interesting one. Uh, maybe they were just kind of uh, going off of uh, everything to go along with that. But that that's cool. That's cool, on my, that's cool on my side. I'll have to double check to see when the last time we got Slam Crate was. Uh, but let's get right into it. And see what we get this month. I'm actually not 100% certain what the uh, theme is. Um, our, uh, that wrestling club our, that wrestling club one was themed through Halloween. Uh, let's see if they do a Halloween or a spooky style thing with uh, Slam Crate this time around. And see what we get this time uh, to go along with everything. Alrighty. So. Okay. Doesn't say right off the bat. Ah, okay. This will be interesting. Let's see what we got. We got our little dude down here. We got our little dude down here. And we've got... Ah, uh, here we go. So, this month, we've got uh, this one's going in. Uh, though, this month's is going to be called Legendary. Uh, so, that's actually a pretty good one. Uh, that's a pretty good indication of what we're probably going to be getting out of this. And I'll be able to see that over here while I'm going to be showing this to you guys. So let's go ahead and start with this one here. Ah, okay. So, oh, let's open this up. Let's open this guy up. It's a little baggy. It's a little bag. Let's see how this actually looks in the end. It's it's called, it is a Jake the Snake uh, style clinch bag. Ah, okay. Okay, there we go. That's kind of nice. So, obviously, in, in the sense of everything, it says for Jake the Sn it says Jake the Snake on there. Everything to go along with it. Obviously, they have a picture of what would be perceived to be Damien <laughs> to go along with that. That's a nice little bag. That's a nice little bag. Something to be uh, that that's something good for carrying around for like tournaments and everything of your uh, taking your controllers or anything like that to say a fighting game tournament or anything to go along with that but that's kind of how i that's kind of how i feel i would probably go with that one uh this month they've kind of gotten away from the championship pins uh they're doing the pins still actually well they haven't really done that uh, they haven't really fully gotten away from the championship ones so this month's one this month's pin is uh dx side plates so it's like the little side plates that would be for the titles that we see now on there. Uh, so they've got variations for the side plates with the pins now, and you get a dueling set of them. That's really actually kind of nice too, that you get a dueling set of the pins instead of just one of them. And also on the small, uh, again, like some of these items are nice and small to go along with this. Oh, <laughs> this one's actually kind of cool though. This one's actually kind of cool. Let's see if I can get it opened. To fully show you guys. It's got tape on it. Of course it's got tape on it. Am I right? Am I right or am I right about tape? Okay. Uh, I'll have to I'll have to hold off on it, but, but that's it's kind of cool. So it is a Razor Ramon, um, so it has full-on Razor Ramon, but it is a toothpick dispenser. That's cool. <laughs> That's kind of cool, actually. I'm not going to lie on that one. I, I kind of dig that one. I do kind of dig that uh, to go along with everything. So for this month, let's see what we have here. For this month... We have ourselves a retro, it looks like it's a retro style shirt, it is a retro style shirt. It is a retro style, uh, Ric Flair style shirt as well, just with a big woo to it. Um, nice, I, I kind of dig, 
I do kind of dig those. I do kind of, I dig the t-shirts. This is a very simple design. Uh, this one's a very simple design with uh, not too terribly much to it, but it kind of gets the point across to go along with everything. So again, I kind of dig this. I do kind of dig these a lot more on the side of everything. In the terms of the box, there's not much to it. Uh, for this month's figure though, this month's figure, this is kind of nice. This one's kind of nice. I kind of like it. And for this one, uh, for this month's, the figure, and it's going to be the traditional ring style figure, it's going to be the ultimate warrior this time around. That's kind of, that's cool as well. Um, nice to, nice to see that they are doing more things with the ultimate warrior, uh, on that side of everything. I like where they're go. Uh, I do like where they're, I, I do like these figures. I really do. And again, for people who, uh, for people who, uh, you know, were watching wrestling, like when I was watching, beginning to watch wrestling as a kid, um, you know, warrior was always somebody uh, somebody was always there i know in the terms of his out of the ring stuff uh leading into his final days were not all that great but you know i go based off of the tv side of everything on that one and i did enjoy that time because i didn't know the guy personally uh to go along with that i always enjoyed uh watching him on tv though so that's kind of how i usually feel about it but i know about the other stories everything to go along with that i know it still can be a kind of a controversial figure with everything but uh, I dig that figure. I like it a lot uh, to go along with it. Uh, and that is basically it for this uh, this month's edition of Slam Crate. I, again, I wasn't expecting to get one this month, but then lo and behold, there it was. Uh, there it was and everything. So I figured I would get a uh, I would get an unboxing for you guys done as quickly as I possibly could on that side. So with that being said, again, I thank you guys uh, for whoever is watching. I hope you enjoyed everything, and we will be back at some point with maybe another unboxing down the road. Um, to be honest with you, I do, this might be the last one for a little while. Uh, this one might be the last one for a little while. It's not an aspect of me necessarily disliking these things. It's more of um, uh, making sure that I have everything in order on my end. So uh, so this might be the last Slam Crate we see for a little while. And next month might be the last that wrestling club we see for a little while. I don't know at this time. <laughs> I don't know at this time, but we will uh, we'll definitely see on everything here. So with that, again, with that being said, I hope you guys enjoyed everything, and I hope you guys have a great rest of your day. Take care. Have a good one.